going lost now? You are a rat. I hate you. Try or not, you want to devour me. Unar musi ko bhava. Again become you rat. Again become rat. Again become rat. Same is the your pet. Krishna is watching you. I gave him this opportunity. Gave him this bath. A uh, really achieved birth, human birth, thereby will develop complete Krishna consciousness. Uh, at the end, has to live of consciousness, that's a completely blossoming consciousness. Uh, then you can see me everywhere and see everything in me. Uh, and you can realize and understand who is he, what is your real identity. Uh, instead of doing that thing, what is doing? Now he's trying to lord it over my property and enjoy. That means he's trying to devour me. Punar musiko. Again you become rat. Again you become dog or hole or tree. Remain in that. Understand? Unless you develop complete Krishna consciousness, then this is good not. This bath, human bath, is meant for doing Krishna Bhajan. Eh? Unless you get true education, spiritual education, Vidya, Bhagavata, Vadhi, this really intelligent, really educationist, eh? the material educationist, they have no true knowledge, true consciousness. They are intelligent, they should introduce Srimad Bhagavatam. Do you understand? This Vedic teachings. Huh? But that branch of knowledge is not here. How is it here? No Krishna bhajan. They are making all human beings gadha. Huh? Shri gadha hoi sansari rubuja vahinu aniko kalo Shri gadha hoi sansari Here is one such ass. There is one such ass. Yeah, there is one such ass. Yes. yes. <laughs> Here is one such ass who for so long has carried on his back the burden of material existence. Yes. <laughs> Getting material education. Ah, very old ass now. <laughs> All life carried heavy burden of material existence on his back. Yes. Yes. Now in my old age, for want of the power to enjoy, nothing pleases me. Nothing pleases me. Jivanodatona hoilo ekono sevidya vidya velo. Jivanodatona hoilo ekono sevidya vidya velo. Agony now. My agony in life has become agony. Huh? Yes. This is the consequence of material education. Huh? Where is peace? Where is joyfulness? Where is blissfulness, Baba? Huh? It's complete and in agony. Suffering, <laughs> suffering, suffering. Three types of. Huh? Afflicted with three types of hates. Huh? Adhyatmika adhida yiviko, adhibhautika. Huh? Isn't it? Yes. Life has become agony now. Yes. My knowledge has proven itself worthless. 
knowledge is proven worthless, this little knowledge. Yeah. Uh, and ignorance has penetrated my heart mm. with the intolerable burning pain of a pointed shaft. Pointed shaft, like treated, pointed, treated, piercing, piercing. This is the consequence of material education. Tumaro Choruno Minaki Sudhano Sosarena Achevaro Chumara Chayata Minaki Sudhana Sosarena to so many in both cities, colleges, in both cities, eh, require this material education, isn't it? Why? So I learn more money, more money, more money, isn't it? Eh? When you are a young man, then you develop interest in acquiring knowledge, isn't it? Eh? Acquiring knowledge, then I'll get uh, a very good government job. I'll become IAS officer or ICS officer. Uh, great. Then I'll earn more money, more money, more money, isn't it? Vidaro Gauro Be Brahmide To acquire this knowledge, material knowledge, I wander many places, ah, huh? Brahmi Jesus from one country to one country. Many Indians coming to the Western world. For what purpose? Earn more money, more money, more dollars. Yeah. India, we cannot earn so much money. If we go to Western country, huh? More money we can. Money, money, money. Only thinking money. Brighter than sunshine, sweeter than honey. <laughs> Not thinking of Krishna. Ah, Marmana Baba, Krishna, who is your real well-wishing friend, he says, Marmana Baba, think of me. Ah, isn't it? But these materialistic persons, they cannot think of him, they never think of him. Krishna, they only think of out of money, 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 more money, more enjoyment, more enjoyment, make nice enjoyment, eating, sleeping, defending, mating, this. Money is not available in India, let us go to Western country and get more money. Country to country, moving, moving, moving. Vidyara Gaurave Bhami Deshe Deshe Dhanu Parjana Kari. Shodal Palan Kariya Kamane Bholi Nuto Mare Hari. Oh Hari, now I am forgetful of you. I am engaged in all these activities, all wandering from one country to another country to get earning more money, more money how to maintain my body, my family members, make nice arrangements of eating, sleeping, depending, mating. I'm completely forgetful of you. Of you? Do you understand? Bhagavata says, Arthendriya thabhidhanu sarvartha pannavo nunam bhansito jnana vijnana jena visadi mukhyadam Srimad Bhagavatam vidya bhagavata vadhi True education is imparted through Srimad Bhagavatam, do you understand? Srimad Bhagavatam is such a Shastra. Bhakti with Siddhan Saraswati Goswami Prabhupada Maharaj says, if all the books, all departments of knowledge, all the books, in the library of the world will be destroyed, 
there will be no loss at all now if Srimad Bhagavatam is there. Understand? There will be no loss at all. It's all the books written in different, different branches of knowledge, whatever. Art, science, physics, chemistry, logic, whatever you may say. Huh? Isn't it? From the library of the world will be completely lost and destroyed. There will be no loss at all. If only Srimad Bhagavatam is there, everything is there. Ah, Bhagavatam imparts such knowledge. Vidya Bhagavatam, he therefore says, the true education imparted through. They are here. Bhagavatam says, Arthindriya Artha Bhidhanu Sarvatha Pannava Nunam Bhansito Gyan Vigyana Jena Visati Bhakyatam. For human society, Constantly thinking how to earn money, money, money. Huh? Why is moving from one country to another country to earn more money, more money? Huh? Isn't it? So what Bhagavata says? For human society constantly thinking of how to earn money and apply it for eating, sleeping, defending, and mating. Huh? Sense gratification brings about the destruction of everyone's interest. <laughs> Brings about the destruction of everyone's interest when one becomes devoid of true knowledge, devoid of devotional service. He enters into species of life like those of trees and stones. <laughs> then this is your pet, great Asia, great Asia. <laughs> Enter into species of trees, महाजन then gives this instruction tumaro choro no bina kichu dhanna ana sansari na che aro tumaro Seek no other treasure in this world than your lotus feet. Krishna's lotus feet is a real treasure. Understand? Real treasure, invaluable treasure. Huh? What value? Huh? Your material treasure, wealth, what value it has? It's subject to destruction in any moment. Huh? Isn't it? But this is real treasure. The lotus feet of Krishna. Huh? Was government that traitor? Huh? Why we attached to this temporary material world? Huh? Was government real traitor in the lotus feet of Krishna? Prem dhana. Huh? Who is rich with that traitor? That dhana, Krishna, prem dhana. Prem dhana bina bepto dori dhodi
Lord, I am your Das. You are my eternal master. I am your eternal Das. But what had happened to me? I have now become a great ass. Yes, very great ass. Completely forgotten you. Huh? I have no attachment towards the lotus feet, which is a real treasure. Huh? I have developed very strong attachment, temporary material objects of enjoyment. Huh? There is no value at all. There is great obstruction in your bhajan. I have developed attachment to this now and suffering. Huh? Do you follow? Ayi nanda tanuja kinkaram padita umma visami bhavam dhu kripaya tavapada pankada sthita nuri sadhra sabi jintaya mahapru teaches this thing. Sikyastra. Ayi nanda tanuja kinkaram padita umma visami bhavam dhu kripaya tavapada pankada sthita nuri sadhra sabi jintaya. O son of Nanda Maharaj, I am your kinka, I am your servant. I am your eternal servant, but what has happened to me? I have become a great ass now. Huh? Acquiring this material knowledge, I am completely forgetful of the goal of my life. To become a great ass. Now I am fallen in this dreadful ocean of materialistic existence. I have been drowning, 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 drowning. Life after life. Huh? Isn't it? Huh? Please, accept me as a speck of dust at your lotus feet. This is prayer. This is prayer. And the same prayer Bhakti Vinata offers. Huh? Your lotus feet is the real treasure. Oh Lord, I have forgotten it. Huh? I'm suffering. Consciousness, they have not only body consciousness, material consciousness, getting this material education, ah, become a great ass. So now I am fallen in this dead place in a material existence, captured by Maya, suffering, suffering, drowning. Kripa kari karamore paradhuli samat tumar seva karo tumar seva now. I am crying. Before you, please accept me as a speck of dust at your lotus feet. Let your servant serve you. Your lotus feet is true treasure. I am devoid of true treasure. Huh? Isn't it? Oh, temporary. No value at all. I have been running, I have been running, running many, many lives. Now, this is my great and law. Huh? Nayanam galada sudharaya abadanam. Gadgada rudhaya gira pula kirni chitir bapu kalatava nam grahane vaisati. Name of Krishna is true knowledge. Do you understand? True knowledge and true wealth. Do you understand? Invaluable wealth. That is invaluable wealth. Nanam galada sudharaya abadanam gadgada rudhaya gira pula kirni chitir bapu kalatava. Huh? As telling that story, hmm? huh? one poor Brahmin was there in Kasi. He was poor. 
was suffering out of poverty. So he was worshipping Sivaji. Sivaji gives opulence, material opulence. Huh? That is Sivaji's Sakapata Krupa. Mercy with duplicity. Those are demons. They offer worship to Sivaji and beg for this material wealth, opulence, name, fame, prestige, give me more enjoyment, more enjoyment. Huh? And see what he grants. All right, the first, the first, get it. Eh? This is Sakapata Krupa. See what is Sakapata Krupa. Mercy with duplicity. Because this is a fool, it doesn't know for the real world. Last him for material world, for Ari. Consequence will be only suffering, suffering, suffering. Doesn't know what is the real world. The lotus feet of Krishna is not asking for that. Eh? You understand? So she got. Sivaji became pleased. All right, you go to Vrindavan. There is Sanatana Goswami. He has wealth. He has wealth. So he will keep you going there. Yeah. So he came to Vrindavan. He inquired, where is Sanatana Goswami? Where is Sanatana Goswami? There is no fixed place. He had no fixed place. Ekaika Prakhyatra, Ekaika Ratri Sayana. He spends one night under one tree, next night under another tree, no fixed. So there he may be sitting under some tree, you may go and find him. So fortunately he found him. Ah, Sanatana Goswami is sitting underneath a tree and getting chanting, Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, 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 Krishna Hare Hare, Hare Rama, Hare Rama, Rama Rama, Hare Hare. And people the best sense, Swamiji. I had come from Kashi and Sivaji had told me that you have wealth. I am poor man. I was with Sivaji. Sivaji says, you to come to you, you have wealth, you will give me. He says, what are you blind man? <laughs> you have to see what wealth I have. Only coping. Can't he cope in one outer way? A tattered rug I have and a water pot, nothing else. I have no fixed place. I am sitting under the tree. How should you say that I have wealth? I will give you. Oh, Sivaji said you have wealth. Huh? Did Sivaji tell a lie? No. When he says like that, then Sanatana says, Oh, oh yes, yes, I remember. I remember. <laughs> One day I was going to take bath in Jamuna early in the morning. Oh, that was very bad day. <laughs> so, by chance that a wonderful touch stone, for so many, touched my feet. This wonderful touch stone, if you touch a piece of iron to it, immediately turn into gold. Such a wonderful touch stone. Ah, that touched my feet. And Sanatana Goswami said, that's a very bad day. <laughs> that's a very bad day. Great Asuk, this is a very good day. A good fortune has come to me. I found such. Huh? <laughs> Isn't it? Huh? Such wonderful touch turn that I will now touch whatever. All iron, all iron, iron ores and mines, then I have good mind now. Isn't it? Sanatana Goswami said, very bad day. <laughs> I killed it. I kicked it. I put it underneath that sand of bar, Jamuna. You may go and get it. Then you get so much wealth. A piece of iron you touch and immediately turn into gold. You went there, fortunately, and found it. You have taken one piece of iron with him, you tossed it and immediately turned into gold. You were amazed. Oh, such wonderful dust on it. Huh? turns a piece of iron into gold, and Sanatana Goswami says it's a very bad day. And he killed it. Definitely he has more valuable wealth than this. Definitely. Otherwise, how can he kick it? Huh? Nobody can kick you. Great ass, can you kick? No. No. <laughs> no, 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 no. You are toiling hard like an ass out on money, money, money. <laughs> so he, this thought came to him. So he came back to Sanatana Goswami and said, 
I am wondering, I am wondering, I couldn't think of how it is that you said a very bad day. Such wonderful trust on that next time, such a piece of iron it to go immediately. You said bad day and you keep it. Nobody can kick it. How can it be? I am thinking you must have more valuable wealth than this. So I want that. I want that. Yes, if you want that, you have to kick it. <laughs> Otherwise you cannot have it. That is the lotus feet of Krishna. Only you. The real treasure here too. Bhakti Nura Thakur says, Tumar Choram Vina Nahi Ardhan. Well, how do you lotus feet? No other valuable wealth they are in this world except your lotus feet. Huh? Sanatana so, Goswami has gotten that treasure, wealth. Therefore he can kick. One who has gotten real wealth, he can kick this. Okay, who can kick this? Great ass, can you kick? No. No? He cannot kick. <laughs> <laughs> And Sanatana Goswami say, you have to kick it if you want that treasure. Then immediately kick it. Yes, definitely want. Because he has gotten real krupa. Eh? Sivaji has two types of krupa. Sakabada krupa, gavda krupa. Krupa with duplicity, krupa without duplicity. Those are Vaishnavas, devotees. They also worship Sivaji to get Krishna Bhakti. Gopis worship Sivaji. Gopeshwar Mahadev is there in Vrindavan, eh? and they for, beg for this, please use Krishna Mahatma, let Krishna be our one point. Eh? That's what you can think of. Vaishnamananda Thasamba. And fortunately he met Sanatana Goswami, the same person, Krishna Kansas, eh? Paramahansa. Same person who only sees Krishna. He never sees the outer dress. Eh? He had never equal vision only sees Krishna. Yaman Pasyati Sarvatra Sarvanta Vai Pasyati Prasya Namparasyami Satame Namparasyami Who sees me everywhere and sees everything in me. Huh? He sees me, I see him. That vision Sanatana Goswami had developed. It's true vision, complete Krishna consciousness. He has got the Krishna Prema, he has bound of Krishna in his heart. He sees Krishna everywhere. Who sees Krishna everywhere? Who is complete Krishna consciousness? Huh? Gotten Krishna, has gotten real treasure, the lotus feet of Krishna. You see the beautiful lotus feet of Krishna, you grow up, he sees only joyfulness, eh? isn't it? Only rejoicing he sees. He never sees material world, which is a place of misery. Huh? Isn't it? So, the Ananda Dekhi, that another song. Bhakti Vino Thakurasi. Atma ni vedana tuya pote kori Ainu paramasukhi Atma ni vedana 